niya. On that Kalita, few for the Kimi and D para sa Alice. Rev Aether at last naman si Chango ating Harit, si Cripzo ang Lolita, Kenji sa Cho, Louie on the Belleric, and Lebron sa kanyang carry. And we are indeed seeing itong git sa gitna is the Kadita but one thing that's really important to take note is mukhang yung Leomord mm -hmm. ang semi 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 na gaano dito semi nagtumutulong dun sa mid sa nagrotate I'm not entirely sure what the idea mm -hmm. here is pero medyo hindi ko na gets kung sinong magiging ano priority nila dito well the thing with Leomord is hindi mo naman talaga sobrang kailangan ng farm sa kanya siguro magsesecure lang ng levels correct sobrang lakas naman ng damage niya when he gets the early level 4. And the fact na tinutulungan niya dito yung Alice at Akadita allows him to rotate. Na maganda siya with the emblem set na pinili dito ni Yaku, which is the Bounty Hunter. So now, you can see a 4-minute level, uh, a 2-minute level for Leomord. Tapos meron ka rin level 4 na Akadita. Nakakatakot sila in terms of team fighting. And I think Aether Atlas should brace themselves for this upcoming oh, rotations ha, coming up from the Kalita. Speaking of rotations, there's the Akai and the Kimi being aggressive on the bottom lane dito. Tingnan natin, but Kenji will spot out the Leomor dito. Sprint agad. Now, that also, because of the two-man rotation sa top ng dalawang tanks ng Aether Atlas, ng playmakers nila, naiwan nila dito si Chango. Nice peel mula sa Signal Ultra. As you said earlier, no, there's the Kadi top na pwedeng tumapat doon sa Harit. Pero makakuha ng uh, counter kill ang Aether Atlas uh, dito. Yako sort of uh, went greedy doon. Medyo mm -hmm. lumabas siya, hindi mm -hmm. siya naghug na kanyang tore. Unfortunately, nagkaroon ng Way of the Dragon si Kenji. Ito na, ito na nga siya napatay. But Sinasabi few. natin na early game yeah. ang uh, hawak ng uh, Signal Ultra uh, babahayan dito. Babahayan niya yung lane tapos magupo siya. That's the thing with the, the side idea. lane. Yeah. The idea with the side lane Kimi. And perfectly done kasi meron din siyang jungle emblem dito. Yes, eto tingnan natin dito, 4-man turtle para sa Aether Atlas. At eto na, papunta na ang Signal Ultra Daisei niya. Ooh, gets no, the turtle actually. Now, na-jumping mo na dito sa kay Cripso. Cripso gets away. Belarik with the ultimate pero kulang na kulang ang kanya sustain dahil masyado pa maaga. That is nice burst two dito. for Signal out Ultra. One. Yeah, pero as you can see, no, trabaho lang dito doon sa Kimi. The same as si, si Kali dito. Pero, hmm, sa tingin mo ba maganda tong nangyayari for Aether Atlas? Kasi, ito na yung sinasabi at nakukuha nila, na nila yung early game advantage. Yeah. Yung map control din yeah, as this, well. This is just scary for Aether Atlas. The fact na nakuhaan sila ng dalawang tore in a span of 3 minutes no, uh, not is good, really not bad. Good. It's not good. Kasi ang lineup dito ng Aether Atlas wanna go for the latter stage of the mm -hmm, game mm -hmm. where the carry is strong. Pero dahil nga naman sa fact na napupusya na sila dito this is not good not good of a sign nahuhuli at as you can see level 4 pa rin yung carry at hindi nga talaga maganda kasi talagang sobra sobrang space yung kailangan mong i-invest sa kanya at yung pinapakita ng signal ultra talagang hindi na nila hinahayaang mabigyan ng space yeah and it's, it's the right idea mukhang rotate na nila si carry he needs to be very very careful dito tingnan natin naku nakaramdam siya Feeling ko ano dito si, si Kuya Few, ano to eh. Yung zero, zero kills, zero deaths, tas puro assists lang na Kimi. Mm -hmm. The support na yun, eh. we need but we don't deserve, <laughs> mga ganun. Pupush na lang to na pupush. Ayan, and then transfer to probably the turtle. Ang yeah. nakita ko rin sa Signal Ultra is they are giving up yung control over the turtle area in exchange for a tower. But they still manage to take, uh, take the turtle. Dahil sa... Initiation mula ID. I think nag-retribution mm -hmm. siya doon with Alice. And grouping up, Pero signal ultra not, dito. Not good then kasi kita mo naman yung uh, gang attempt nila, yung pick-off attempt nila. Wala silang nakuha. Tapos ang dami pa nilang nag-commit doon. Yeah. On top. They Ayun need no? to defend this tower. Tingnan natin. Ang ganda rin ng... I think there's a good synergy dito sa Kimi tsaka dito sa Kadita in terms of pushing. Kasi yung ginawa lang, lang dito, nagtanim lang ng, ng stun yung Kadita. At ito, ayan o, di ba? Inaabangan lang. Tapos mapatay agad yung Belleric. Who go down? That's the Belleric, mga kaibigan. Just like that, makakuha na naman ang kilang signal ultra. Pero dito, makakahuli silang dalawa. There's the Zaman Force used by the Harit. Nahuli pa dito ang Lolita. Pero wala, kulang na kulang yung damage pa ng Aether Atlas dito. Pero on the back line, they will spot out Kenji. Pero makatakbo, Yaku will go for the chase. Kenji, makakatakas pa ata siya dito. Running out for his life, but Yaku... Nakaganapin, hindi ka makakatakbo. 
really I think there was one Jeet Kundo na ginawa niya instead forward or instead na pabalik dun sa kanya base. Mm -hmm. Medyo backwards papunta dun sa air nung, nung Liam Ward. I think that made a yeah. difference. I think that he would have escaped. Pero dahil dun sa isang isang ano na yun, sa pag sa paggamit nun. May issue na kukulangan din ako sa crowd control ng Aether Atlas, no? There, they, Wala yeah. sila masyadong CC. Yeah, kasi naglolita lang sila dito. Yeah, Tapos pero view. Na Ito na sinasabi natin, makakatakbo na naman dito. Pero ayun na, kita mo na yung damage ni Kimi. Mm -hmm. Kimi, ayun na, diba? 0-0-1. Not exactly the most explosive play in the world. Pero at least, pero diba? It, it, it gives you the win that you needed. Diba? May kita natin. You need, tutulak but they don't deserve. Tutulak na ito ng tutulak. Walang na objectives. Contest the enemy. And katulad na sinabi kanina, maganda yung parang the double, yeah. double K combination ng Kadita at Kimi. Pag nagpupush, ang gagawin double lang K. ni Kadita, lalagyan, eh, lalagyan lang niya yan ng pag-stun niya dun sa natory. Hindi makalapit. Hindi makalapit. Tapos yung Kimi, Actually, tutulak lang. Yan. Ito, tingnan natin. Kung, uh, very spammable. Pero spammer. nagka... nagkakaambahan na sila dito. Very spammable skill. This, is a, this will be a 4v4 Uy. fight. Pero, tingnan natin dito, Luwe. Naku po, tingnan natin, hindi nila asimin. He is here. Zaman Force actually activated, but for nothing. Yikes. At ito na naman, ang huling outer turret para sa Aether Atlas. Six yeah, minutes objective in. Objective talaga ang uh, priority dito ng Signal Ultra. And, you know, you can see the discipline. Talagang hindi, hindi, hindi nila priority yung kills. No, minang blast kinakasa na dito. Gala connect on to just one. And this is bad. Belerick ultimate as well as the, the Lolita's ultimate already used. And this will give Signal mm -hmm. Ultra the license to go to the turtle. Napaka dali, uncontested mula sa Aether Atlas. And that is indeed the turtle to be slain. Tapos ang gagawin pa nila, i-invade din nila yung jungle ng Aether Atlas. So, ang means na lang ng farm nila dito is yung mga, upka, uh, mga papuntang minion. So, tingnan natin, mag-burst down na naman yung Belerick. This oh. is not good. 0-3. Eee. Oh man. And now the push continues para signal all drop up drama dito sa gitna. Oh, talo mula sa Kai, meron ng hurricane. That's at nahuli nga yung carry dito of all the people to no, be caught. Yun pa, meron pang na burst dito. That's the Lolita down. A Kai will be the sacrifice. Yaku, buhay na buhay. Wala doon sa mm -hmm. damage ng Tore at medyo na pasama ang pwesto ni Kuyeti. Yep. At least nakakuha sila ng uh, konting bawe. Konting bawe. But konting this... bawe. Pero Kenji will spot out the... oh, no. Leo more dito. Oh, Nakapita siya yun. Double Actually, kill. Actually get the kill pero ito na. Daisenia and Few. The double K combination. Oo. Oh, the Kadita Kimi combination. Sayang nakakuha ng kill dito si Few. 1-0-3. Okay sana yung ano eh. 0-0 tas puro assist lang na pushing Kimi. But for now... You we saw the turret already taken out by mm -hmm. Signal Ultra inhibitor dun sa my top. And further increasing the lead to 8,000. 8 minutes pa lang, Madam Aki. Ganto na kalaki yung lamang ng Signal Ultra. At don't forget na nakapag high ground push na rin sila. Mm -hmm. so, so, that's a very... Mm, <laughs> mahirap, mahirap nang sabihin kung meron pa rin chance makabaw yung Aether. Pero... Bilog ang, ano, bilog ang ML, sabi nga natin, di ba? Easy, easy Bil comeback. Bilog ang, ang ano. Pero ang, speaking of comeback, what are the means, no? What are the factors na pwedeng uh, maka-comeback itong it's Aether Atlas? At oh, well, now, I think the biggest factor that Aether Atlas could mm -hmm. bear on is yung punish that they could get from Signal Ultra. Kasi maraganda yung kanilang punish uh, potential dito. Zaman Force is there, Lolita... With the uh, Nominal Blast, pwede pang punish oh, din yan. Pero hindi, hindi siya makaano eh. Hindi niya maforma masyado yung Zaman Force eh. Medyo kulang. Yeah. Eh, kasi ang kinakalaban niya puro mga mobile eh. Kasing mobile niya. Oo. Oh, oh. Kailangan niya kasi na additional, di ba? I think, yeah. yes, the Nominal Blast is there. Pero ang hirap nila timing. Hindi siya tulad ng Harith plus Minotaur combo talaga oh. super deadly. And then you also have the Belric na super defensive type of core. At the, you know, they have to play around... Luwe, this time. Kasi siya yung may ultimate na pwede magsalba ng oh, laban. Oh, pero Hurricane oh, Dance. They will spot out Chango dito. Ayun na nga, Harit. Grabe. Ang, uh, priority, priority kill dito ng Signal Ultra. They will actually get it. At ito na nga, ma-open na ang chance sila to go for the Lord na uncontested pa rin. Yeah, I think it... Yeah, hindi, hindi, kailangan na nila mag-defend eh. Nakakapasok na yung mga minions sa base nila. So, talagang hindi sila makakalaban dito. That's has been on point with the Akai. Kahit pa sabihin natin isa na yung mahuli niya, but for the past few clashes, 
lagi yung important targets yung ganun nahuli. Mm-hmm. Like, if you look back a few minutes before, yung nahuli niya agad yung carry. So, the, the moment na nakita niya yung carry, activate agad ng 1,000 pounder, talo na agad, lock down agad yung core. And now this yeah. time, kahit pa solo lang doon sa Harit, it's fine. It's a Harit na kanya nahuli, which really negates the fighting chance for Aether Atlas. So, I think that's yung kanyang decision making dito in terms of jumping. Yeah. Really, Chris, parang hindi mahalaga kung makakuha ka ng ng 3-man hurricane dance or 4-man hurricane dance kahit, kahit isa lang, isa lang eh, sulit, mo, sulit. as long as it's a core it's mm-hmm. sulit na nga pero kahit sabi mong Belerick yung makuha nila sulit pa rin eh kasi ito yung ano nila eh, defensive uh, yeah. defensive hero nila so kung mamatay si Belerick dito they will don't, uh, they don't have the chance para maging safe pero they will go for the high ground push dito yeah, and that just is like a, that an easy inhibitor Signal, parang signal. Ultra, tumalit na dito si D. Wala ang pakilam. Oh, Meron no. naman siya ko doon. Si Kenji, naku po, napasama pa. That's a monster kill. Leomard goes down, but it doesn't matter dahil paubos na paubos na dito ang mga miyembro ng Aether Atlas. It's 2 for 1 and mukhang base. Ay, Ay madudurog na, na, madam. Wala That's na. That's it. 2-0 for signal. Ultra against Aether Atlas. Hindi rin namatay si Kimi, no? Ay, Hindi. si Kari. Si Kari. Namatay, namatay ba siya? Namatay si Kari. Yeah. Kari was picked, up, picked off by Signal Ultra. And that was... Sort of a fast pace.